refused to me because they said that she had too many claims that she didn't get her food or something was wrong with her food. And I think it's only right. Now, I, I've only had one customer. Uh, sorry, excuse me. I've had two customers in my five years who claimed that they did not get their food. But I had proof that they did. So anyway, the story is they said no because they compensated me in the past. Customer claims DoorDash refused to refund her for orders she did not receive. Apparently, if they have to give you multiple refunds, they would just stop giving you refunds. No, they should stop you from ordering as well. In a viral video, a TikToker known as at Hell's Bug 2 calls out DoorDash for not giving her a refund or any credit after the delivery driver dropped her food off to the wrong house. Now, if that delivery driver actually dropped her food off to the wrong house, okay, then I can see her getting a refund. But there must be a picture of the um, drop-off proving that this driver dropped her food off at the wrong house. She claimed that the problem is a fault in their business model. Do you think that a customer who has multiple complaints about not getting their order or multiple complaints about their order being dropped off, do you think that they should get a refund? Hell no. Hell no. And what they should do is stop them from ordering. I think that any time a customer that did actually get their order, because I had a customer right in back of me, that's the only reason why I got up that night. Now, mind you, I live in Detroit. I don't dash in Detroit. It got to be really, 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 really worth my while. So I'm, I'm laying here. I turned on the amp, and it was really, really, really worth my while. The drop-off was the very next block from me. The pickup was less than a mile away. Actually, it is like, it's not even a half a mile away. It's down the street. Picks up the order, drop the order off, take my picture while he's, because I told him to, even told him to check his order before I left. The next day, I get a contract violation. This bald head mother said that he didn't get his food. I went back over to his house, because mind you, it's right on the next block. I showed him the picture. You're a moron, and you tried to steal from McDonald's. So I think people who do that should not be allowed to order at all. Thank you so much.